think I heard you huff all day yet. Did you huff? I'm sure I did. I didn't hear it. It says it's ready to display messages. Well, look at you go. But it's not displaying it. It doesn't have that same little thingy on it that it normally does. You know. Says it's Alrighty. online. I don't know. <clears throat> Is there? Yes. Where's the boot? Why is it not? Oh, there we go. Hi, Maxine. Hi, Char. How is everybody? How are you? Oh, I'm great. Today was wonderful. Misty um, didn't huff or anything. There wasn't a bunch of problems. It's all good. I just did it under my breath. We have got a ton, a ton, a ton to cover. I feel like the camera's off. Is, that, is this okay? Do I need to lower a little bit? Do whatever makes you happy. <laughs> hey, sissy. Got Texas in in the house. Texas in the house, and Kim, oh Kim Myers. Oh Kim. Oh, oh Kim. Oh Kim. Kim. I'm gonna send you an email, hun. I did a little something for you. Yeah, and it turned out great. And she kept saying, "It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work." Yes. It well, is. you know, I finally I like stayed awake at night about doing this for her, <laughs> and finally I came in yesterday and I said, "Kim, I've just come to a decision." I'm just going to do it. Well, she and called if, on Labor Day, and I was here working. The store wasn't open, but I was here working. And I was like, yeah, you call. I'll answer the phone. It was Kim. And I was like, okay, I'll tell Misty when she gets back all the things I promised she could do for you. Mm -hmm, and I did. did. And, you know, hey, it's just a wig, right? If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. We just get a new one. But it, but it out. did. All right. It's going to ship out probably today for you, Kim. Hi, Lisa from Chicago. Ooh. Brenda's coming to us from Facebook. Yay. South Carolina. Hot and muggy Connecticut. Oh, I don't need no hot and muggy. It is still hot here. Although this morning it was 73 in my car. When I was the away. mornings and the evenings have been very nice. And it. I don't even think it hit 90 yesterday. And we've had these like thunderstorms that come in and they cool everything off. Hi, Maria. I talked to you several times. And Denise, all these familiar names yes. coming up. I wish we could see your faces, too. I know. That would be fun. They can always post a picture in their comment. We could. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know if we'd see it, though. All right. A um, couple things before we get started. Yeah. You're going to have to couple them up because I don't even know what's going on. Well, John Renault has just rolled out the California mm -hmm. Blonde Collection in a whole bunch of styles. Some of the styles, I really don't understand why they did it, but they did. <laughs> the things that we're most excited about is uh, Natalie, Natalie Petite, Jazz, Jazz Petite, all now come in California Blonde Collections. Lily, Naomi. Lily, Gabby, yeah, Naomi, Angelique. Angelique. Which Angelique is kind of like Hunter by Tony Beverly, only it's machine made and it's not hand tied. So style wise, it's very similar. Great and obviously, it, 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 if it's machine made, it's going to be a better price point. And so, it's part of their Oso Light collection, too. So, you get longer hair with super, super lightweight cap. Yes. Peaches. Yeah, peaches. Anyway, there's a whole a list. Are they on the website? <laughs> I'm so mean. Okay, they'll be on the website soon. I got like maybe 10 of the Ellen Villas done. I ain't even joking. I'm sure Georgia's probably going to watch this, and she knows my frustration. I've, like, had to email her so many times because they – it's confusing. We're okay? learning. We are learning. It's very confusing. The only good thing is that each style comes in – I forgot my bracelet – like, maybe 10 colors max, yeah. you know. So, that makes it better. That way I don't have to search through because, oh, my goodness, y'all. Oh, we've got England. We've There's got Canada. There's yeah, you have to. Jan's coming to see us in December. Yay. Okay, so you <laughs> want to get started because we this this well, is going to be. Well, first of all, we, got, we need to mention what we got on. Oh, I'm on Jolie by Noriko and Misty did her magic. And Mocha Highlight. And Mocha Highlight. And your lip sense, me. Oh, my lip sense is Kiss, Kiss for, for Katie. Kiss and for a cause. Kiss for a Cause and Mystic Berry Gloss. 
Yeah, I already forgot. I know what yours is. I don't know what mine is. I'm wearing Jet in chocolate smoke. Y'all know that. Um, Did you put anything in it? Oh, just a tad. <laughs> so I always preface this. If you order Jet, it does not look like this out of the box. All I've done to it, though, is product. It doesn't have any kind of steaming or anything done on it. Lots of peace out cream, um, dry shampoo, and hairspray. All right, we've got a couple questions. Uh, yes, you should call the store if you want lip sense. We cannot sell that online. And someone asks, is it normal for wig shops to cut out the tags and refuse to tell you what wig you're wearing? I would say, um, it, no, it's not it normal. Be. It does happen. And, uh, you know, that's their way of not trying to make sure you have to come back to them. Uh, I would like for people to come back to us because we offer great service and we have a nice shop and wonderful people that work here so we keep some the tags days. in it some days we have <laughs> yeah, some, over here <laughs> some, days. some days you get a you know a lot of huffs but you know yeah all right um and someone just asked if lip sense is good for dry lips i'll tell you what's good for dry lips the gloss yeah. um i wear the color maybe twice a week and but i wear the gloss every day love the gloss and i wear the color every day but on the weekends, sometimes, if I'm just running around with no makeup, I'll throw on the gloss because it just gives me a little color. But the uh, the gloss is wonderful for moisturizing your lips. Yes. Wonderful. All right, are you ready? Oh, did you hear that German accent? Oh, yes. That was a little segue into... What? Ellen Villa. Yes. Ellen Villa is wonderful. Yes. Okay. No, wunderbar. Well, I don't, I'm not that... By that would be trilingual because we all know I can count to uh, five in Spanish, so that's my second language, and so German will be my third. Um, <laughs> you know, I don't want to impress anybody too much just yet. I'm holding that off for later on. My sister had to teach me how to say I don't speak German because she told me it's rude for me to sit there and stare at them when they're speaking German you to, to me. No habla. You say kein Deutsch. <laughs> no habla. And so she taught me that. The, no Deutsch. Yeah. <laughs> and then they immediately start talking English. Anyway, it's funny. Oh, goodness. Okay, we're going right. to go. We're going to go. We're going to go fast. Yes. You say we're going to go fast, and we never go fast. This is going to go fast, because I had a dream last <laughs> night that we went way too long, and it was just awful. She did. She had a dream. We went an hour and 45 minutes, so if y'all need to take a bathroom break, you better go now. I had a dream. We went an hour and 45 minutes, and some man came out and said... I'm giving you 15 more minutes, and I'm cutting off the internet for the whole building. <laughs> Watch out, Patrick, if you're watching. I might cut y'all out. Patrick's at the pool works next door. Okay. What's first? Misty is going to list everything we're trying on by time. It'll be time and date stamped. It is 24 wigs. It probably won't get done till maybe in the morning, but she's going to work as fast as she can this afternoon. So if you lose track of what we've got on, it will be up. So, yeah, just jot down the name if you like it, and then you can always go back to the description. Um, sometimes oh, Facebook sorry. doesn't um, do the timestamps right, but YouTube always does. So, go back to the actual YouTube video, pull down the description box, and then underneath our whole little introduction, you'll be able just to click on the little time, and it'll take you to that spot in the video. What All is right. this called? This is called Flirt in Saffron Brown Rooted. It is a lace front. Okay, for some reason, I think we might be getting two flirts. So, I don't have on the saffron brown rooted, so there, you want, was, there were two. You don't want to dig through the whole box? Well, there were two. I don't have my... What kind of box do you have? Did I get lucky? Sorry, y'all. Sorry. Nope. We literally just opened the box. Nope. There we go. I didn't know... Oh, so now we got a switch. I like this wig. One of the things we're still uh, noticing is we need a switch because saffron brown. There we go. One thing we're noticing is the density of the hair is so fine, and it is. <gasps> this is comfortable. Yeah, this wig is comfortable, and nothing is too much hair. So if you what are they saying that this cap is size-wise? It's, it's got to be petite average and lots of stretch because this has a lot of stretch. Saffron brown is more like a red. Oh, I would wear this. That's I'm, so pretty. Pearl blonde rooted. Yeah. Flirt, flirt, 
These are regular fiber. They are not heat defiant. No, they are not. Okay, and I'm everything we're showing today has a wefted back. Some of them do have a mono crown, a lace top, lace front, um, but everything is. This has an extended lace part, mono part, and it is petite average. Okay. All right. This is touch, and this is tobacco rooted. Oh, I didn't put my liner on. That's what happens when she just. This is me. also a lace front, and it is a mono part. Uh, we're not really familiar with this color, but it sure is pretty. Ooh, it is pretty. That reminds me of the SS924 by Raquel, part of that cool Lawns collection. You know, it's long, but it doesn't feel so long. Yeah, it's got layers in it. This is like a more relaxed out, uh, oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Relaxed out version of like Finn. This is a say. hard length to find because they're either longer or shorter. Julie that's, says that Touch is one of her favorites. Oh, Lynn has it in Candy Blonde Rooted. Lynn, Lynn Brady? No, Lynn um, Satori. Oh. It just doesn't come up, Lynn. I just know that's her. All right, that's pretty. Uh, hang on, hang on. Bangs on flirt. I think so. Yeah. As long as it... Okay, I just had to correct someone that called me. <laughs> She's like, you said you don't want to cut a bang in anything, and that's not true. It's the heat defiant that I don't want to cut a bang in. So if it's not heat defiant, it's regular fiber. Generally, I'll say yeah. But it also is style dependent. So even some of the ones that are regular fiber... If it's going back away from your face and it's lace front, it gets a little tricky. Touch. Ooh, this, you're going to like this. Well, I'm still trying to see if I like touch. Well, you touch and I'm going to turn. Wait, What's the color on this? All right, well. What do you think? Did you see the back? Yeah. That is so pretty. Oh, I like this. I mean, this would need to be steamed a little bit away. That really looks like you just kind of were at the beach and you got out of the water and it's kind of got salt in it. And... Okay, turn is a really... I still didn't put my line on. <laughs> to get... Okay, this is turn in Bernstein Rooted. I had a conversation with our rep, Georgia, this morning about the pronunciation. And... It can be Bernstein. In Germany, they call it Bernstein. Eclat can be Eclat or Eclaw. Germany or, calls it Eclaw. Or Eclat. I saw that today, too. They call it Eclat here. So oh gosh, what it really boiled down to was tomato, tomato. But I, we did do the research on the pronunciations because we want to pronounce things the right way. All right, this is turn. This reminds me... Oh, that's cute. Of like winter, a little bit more curls than winter. Yeah, but oh, it's nice. And it's um the cap is stretchy. It's comfortable. It is comfortable. I think what it boils down to a lot of the ones that we did last time on our unboxing had um they didn't have as much wefting. Ooh, this is like, this would be such a cute, like, flapper wig. I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, someone just said nobody does curls like Ellen Villa. Well, we are just about to find out. <gasps> oh, are we? Hang on. Misty has wanted a wig like this and talked about it for years. You, The color not... is aubergine. Means eggplant. Wait, we got it. We got to preface this one. Aubergine rooted. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh, steam, steam. This is called disco. Wow. <laughs> I ain't laughing, but I might be laughing. Bernadette Peters. Is that her name? Oh yeah, this is definitely Bernadette Peters. No, is it Bernadette Peters? Yeah. Or Rosanna, Rosanna Dana, or something? No, it's Bernadette. 
So we have people that come in, and I know this is not my style, but we have people that come in all the time that have natural curl. Uh huh. And it's hard to find something with natural curl. And this would replicate someone. That would even be cuter if you, like, cut, just did a flat out, like, messy bang. Yeah. Gilda Radner. There you okay, go. Okay, Gilda. Yeah, this is Gilda. Roseanne, Roseanne, Dana. Now, well, see, I had that, but I didn't know what her real name was. Okay. But, again, the cap is stretchy. And the curl pattern. And it's lightweight. Feel how lightweight that is. The curl pattern looks like a perm. And it looks like natural curls. It is so cute. I can't wait to put this on. This is not going to be my color. But it has mini lace front. I don't know. Now, this is one you definitely don't want to run, run a brush through. <laughs> oh, yeah, if you want to ruin it. I don't think I um, described the cap construction on that. Oh, my gosh. That. Look how happy you are. I am. I don't have glasses or anything to read what oh that is. Oh, my gosh. What? what, what What's what the cap construction on that? I didn't Mini say. lace wefted. Okay. Yeah, just that little bit of wet lace somewhere. Like, did I have it? Do I have it tucked? Yeah, yeah you have it tucked under. Okay, let me start this over because I, I'm, I, I'm sorry. we got to spend some time on this one. I have to have this wig. Oh, my. I like that color on you. It's fun. I had this hair. I would scrunch it and use some liquid. Beth says it's precious. Beth, you could wear this. Oh, yeah, Beth. Is that Beth Franklin? Yeah. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Just look at that movement. Did you turn around? All right, Georgia. You got to get me a color in this. Okay. All right. I like that. It even feels like real hair that's been permed. Okay, moving right along. All right, fine. Uh, you can put it on after. Howard Stern. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Okay. Kind of Howard Stern. Wave Deluxe in Champagne Rooted. Okay, let's find this. This Wave is a partially hand, partially hand tied, which means it's fully hand tied except for the very back where they've put the mesh but they've sewn in the machine made wefts. Marsha's gonna love that. This one. Disco. Okay, that's cute. Alright, this one feels a little small and it is um, hand tied so it's it I is? expect it to run small. Wave Deluxe. I could have swore they said all wefted bags. What they do, they have two different, they have a four star and a five star. A four star is a hand tied wig that has the Hand, the machine made weft sewn in the back 100% fully hand tied is fully hand tied and that's it five stars it's wefted. it says it's wefted mm -hmm. well it's not what is a PU ear tabs polyurethane yeah polyurethane I can feel it Okay. this is cute it is cute. Okay, you know what? This is a good option for that John Renault has now just discontinued the Felicity. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this would be a good option. And for Felicity. this mid length is so hard to find in any manufacturer. I'm just loving that whole Howard Stern comment. Sorry. <clears throat> Ooh, it is little. So little. I oh, wear this. Sonia. I'm sorry you had a bad morning. I'm glad we can brighten your day. I can't wear this at all. So, look, if you got a, a larger head. Yeah. Don't don't go with No Wave Deluxe. This is great for a petite. All right, this next one is Ocean in Sandy Blonde Rooted. It is a mini lace mono part. It's comfortable. I still think the most comfortable one that I've had on so far is the flirt. But this this comes all the, this is actually this is really good. So this has Ooh, got layers. That's Isn't that too. pretty? That's so pretty. It's got good layers. I wonder could you do <laughs> Lynn said that one was boring. I think she's talking about the Wave Deluxe. That's so pretty. So this is going to be something 
you know, you wanted holiday hair, put it up. Okay. Nice. I'm, I'll rush myself just like I rush you. I don't like to be rushed. Don't I know it. Only when I'm doing the rushing. <laughs> Which I do that all the time. So this could have a good wispy all across thing. That's beautiful on you. Did you see how this falls in back? Oh! Sorry, your fingernail got caught in my hair. Oh, sorry about that. They make really pretty blondes, too. They make many pretty colors. We're still learning the colors and the blends and what the differences are, but we're getting there. One thing I did want to ask Georgia, and if she's watching, she might jump on, is I, I've gathered that most of the rooted colors have the same color root. There's not like, you know how John Renault has that lighter root, the 12 versus the 8, and they have some of the aesthetic it has a 4 and an 8. This is Elite and Hazelnut Mix. It is a lace front, mono part. Let's see if I can get this. And just because it's going to get asked, can you put a bang in this? Well, I don't want to say yes or no. So I not misquote me. Oh, well, they're going to misquote you. You know what? I, I don't know why you would because well, last time we showed that really cute style. It's on the website now. I can't remember the name of it. But it already has bang. It's almost like um, an Alva. Oh, About yeah. the same length. It's pretty. Okay. Lynn's That's asking pretty. if um, Ellen Villa has pretty craze. Yes, they do. They don't make a ton of them, but yes. You're going to see some today. Oh, well, what do you know? And another thing I've noticed for those that are like me that have a shorter forehead, even if these don't have a bang, they're not real heavy around the face, so you can get away with, where's the hair at? You can get away with um, not doing anything in it. This has a little bit of a stack. That's cute. That hazelnut mix color, I don't know if you can really see it. The blend is absolutely gorgeous. And that's one of the things that Ellen Villa herself does is she decides the mix. And so they are truly hand-picked. Yeah, it's really pretty. Okay, this next one. I have a lady coming in tomorrow to try this. I told her I can't, you can't eat, we can't even look at it till Wednesday, but after Wednesday you can look at it. All right, this is called light mono in a snow mix. It is a mono top, full mono top, no lace. It's a warm tone. That someone's asking if the hazelnut is a warm tone. Definitely warm. Oh, she will like this. Yeah, she's gonna love it. Very short yeah, well, neckline. Almost like a Zoe from Renee Paris. I always try to like compare it to something because if you're familiar with other brands, it's just a little bit flatter, not as spiky. But yeah, the sides are kind of short, but it's got a little bit of there, a little bit of hair there. Seems like there was some other announcement I needed to make. Good little pixie. Um, Colleen, I was looking for this customer for snow mix, and yeah, it, it doesn't come in a whole lot, but it is an absolutely beautiful mix blend. Okay, this is Vista in light honey rooted. And this is a, what they call a basic cap. So it's a 100% um, machine made cap. This is kind of like. We showed something last time kind of like that. It's cute. Almost reminds me of Corey. A little bit by 
There we go. Yeah, this is a little bit small for me. But a lot of times with Cory, there's too much fullness here for people. And this, if you wanted just a cute little bob, this is great. Maxine says it's a Dutch boy, Bob. It is. Just a normal lefty cap. So. I'm in the bank Sarah says she has Vista and it is so comfortable. I found it to be comfortable as well. This is a pretty color. I don't think I've seen this before. Okay. Okay. This next one is called Sky. Not to be confused. But, yeah. And this is called uh, Dark Sand Rooted. And this color is so pretty. This is a uh, what they call a basic cap. So it's machine made. It's got a mono crown. And this color for me seems similar to... Um, sugar cane a little bit a little bit kind of a cross between because it's got warmth to it oh, what am i doing wrong what's the back look like is it wispy or um it's smooth? kind of spiky it's kind of like a zoe back cocoa back i think maybe. you could probably make this look asymmetrical you want to put one side behind your ear it's cute it is cute i love love this color yeah it almost to me looks like also like a um, strawberry swirl with a root very comfortable okay what's going on with the part i couldn't figure it out and I don't know if it if they've done it like that so that you have options if you wanted to wear it straight down. But I think, or if they did it that way so that you could decide if you wanted right or left part. Kind of like that, the last time we did an unboxing, there was one that had that, that weird kind of cold set thing. I think this is the same thing. That you could probably just do it either way. But That's cute. I need some work on the bang, yeah, that, bang area. Okay, this one's called Smoke High Mono. Is that like you're high on smoke? I guess I don't know. so. And the color is Chocolate Mix. This is a ear-to-ear -ear lace front mono part. Another great bob. This one has a little more face framing than the last one we had on. But again, that lace goes... That looks like Cameron, after I've cut it for you. That lace goes all the way to there. So it's further than temple to temple. Not quite as um, far down as like to here. But this is cute. I like this chocolate mix color, and I don't know how well you can see it, but it's got warmth to it. But again that signature Ellen Villa blending is just beautiful. I think we're going faster this week. Someone's asking um, if the chocolate is cool. No, it's it's a little on the warm side. I haven't found a real cool brown yet yeah. from them. 
Um, Gloria's asking if the caps on these wigs are comfortable. They are, and we think that, um, we're trying to say as they are, they're petite average. Some have more stretch than others. Our heads are kind of on the large side, but um, I'm, we're trying to tell you as we go along because I know a lot of you want to wear Ellen Villa, but people have been a little bit apprehensive because of the cap size. So this is called Sunset and Hot Chili Mix. Yeah, and anything that's wefted, I found that, don't you think that it's more stretchy? Yeah, any of the wefted ones are definitely. The fully hand-tied ones are a challenge for us to get on. This is a lace front mono part. Oh, wait, what is this? I'm sorry. This is called Sunset, Sunset. and Hot Chili Mix. And so Ooh, the, I've been wondering what that. The um, first time we showed the Ellen Villa, we had a couple of people comment, "You didn't show any red." Well, that's red. That's red. So that looks like opulence from Gabor. A good alternative to that. This cap is comfortable. I've got good stretch out of it. The ear to ear feels good. It just the the amount of hair in these wigs is amazing. Yeah. Because sometimes if you get one with this amount of hair, you can kind of see through if you move your head or whatever. But no, these are good. That's a cute style. All right, what do we got? It's just so nice to be able to put something on without a bang that doesn't fall in my face. Yeah, and they're... One of the things that we're noticing, because we've had people ask about the price point, because they are more expensive, and one of the things we're noticing is the hand blending of the colors. The lace is incredible, and what one of the things that I noticed on my eclat, some of the manufacturers are now putting a lighter color at the front so that you don't see the dark knots. While on the eclat with the rooted blonde, what they've done, it's literally hand done. I mean, hand selected, it's blended. So it's not like they had a recipe of this stripe is blonde. Mm -hmm. And then you go back into the other. Whoever's putting these together has to be very careful about how they do it. And they do a fabulous job. And so you don't get that white stripe look, which is better than the dark knots, but you get a much improved uh, look. The last, what is this called? The, oh, I'm sorry. This is called night and this is stone gray mix the last time i wore my eclat i went to pick us up lunch and so out in the sunlight i'm like really examining it because you know the sunlight shows everything um and i even took a picture and the lace just i zoomed it in the lace is so amazing yeah so and there's nice. so many nuances that, that we're noticing you, know, you look in the cap and you're like wow Somebody really took a lot of care to put that together, so I don't know. This is cute. It is cute. It this almost, is. Oh, go ahead. This is a uh, basic cap, so it's fully machine made. This color is beautiful. That looks like a Starly. It already has kind of a bang cut in it. Yeah, it's it shorter than Starly. I don't wear Starly, mm -hmm. so I don't know. No, it's about like a Starly. That's a good option for Starly. It has a little bit of bang, and that color is great. Yeah. The stone gray mix. I couldn't decide if they meant for the stone gray to be one word or two, so I kind of just put it the way they did. Um, but it's kind of it has a little bit of that'd a, be pretty on Lynn Brady. And Beth, yeah, Lynn, this would be a good Beth color Franklin. on you. Um, but it has that lighter front, kind of like the Silverstone by Noriko or a 92 by Don Renault. Cute, and y'all know I love me a messy, 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 messy wig. And that lightweight, too. Yes. Cute. Actually, I think the back on this is different than Starly in the fact that Starly kind of has that flip out. Yeah. This is more kind of curl. This is cute. Well, I think the neckline, it's definitely, I think, shorter than Starly in the back. Okay. Cute. This is called Open, and this is Hot Chili Mix. And this is a basic machine-made cap, and it's got a mono crown. Oh, 
I'm gonna put hot chili rooted because that's what was on the. Yeah, it is hot chili rooted. Did oh, I not say that? Hot chili mix. Oh, sorry. Something. I'm telling you that if a lot of the things are called the same thing, but they're different. <laughs> so I'm hot chili rooted. Mm. That looks like that other one that we showed in. What was the short one that we're holding for Miss Merle? No, this is. Um, not not that one. The one that looked like the dark sand rooted one. I don't know. Sky. Oh, Sky. Yeah. Yeah, a little bit shorter version of Sky. <gasps> oh, no. My stack's falling. But this color is pretty with the root. Mm hmm. It's real pretty. A little bit of depth. Ooh, that is. Maxine says, okay, I need three. Well, if you see something that you like, um, and, and it's not on the website, all you gotta do is give us a call. I mean, it's an ordeal to put these on there, so don't ever think you have to wait until something's there. Just call me. Email me. You know, um, a lot of people like that kind of toward the face. Look. Well, remember the lady that came in the other mm -hmm. day? She wanted all of it toward her face. Because that's what some people equate to a pixie. And so. Right. Okay, this is Girl Mono, and it's chocolate rooted, and it is a lace front mono part. And again, this is on the warm side of brown but it's a really pretty color it is pretty the only thing cool um kim's asking about cool browns the only thing cool i found is that one that the tobacco was that it mm -hmm. the tobacco rooted one had some cool tones it wasn't really technically brown but it was on the cool side yeah and wendy says what she likes about the ellen villa curl is it looks like natural curl. Mm -hmm. It doesn't look like something you've done with a curling iron or. And it's so lightweight. The curl doesn't weigh it down. <sighs> this is cute. This is a definitely a it's style cute. that nobody else makes anything like. Okay. I'm oh, Maxine, don't leave us, please. I'm about to say something. What you gonna say? Let me put it on first and see. If anybody is familiar with the style that Noriko used to have called Mariah. They still have it. Oh, yeah, they do. Well, this is like a less hair version of Mariah. Yeah, you're right. Like and this. it's so much lighter weight. I just... You can really get that, that color. Of course, you don't want to see my That color is... Beautiful. But really get that off the face, whereas Mariah had a full bang. Okay. Very cute. Very comfortable. Everything we've shown you so far is a traditional fiber. What I'm about to show you now is a heat defiant fiber. That's what I want. What is it called? It is called. Taboo, and it's rosewood rooted. And I don't know if anybody else makes a color like this. Oh, it's kind of pinky orangey. It is um, mini lace and lace and uh, mono at the crown. Oh, this cap is comfortable. This cap is so comfortable. So you've got that little bit of lace right here where That's it breaks. Pretty. I like that color. I do too. It's different. We've never had anything like that. It's kind of like if you had dark hair and you wanted that blorange color, mm -hmm. but deeper. That's pretty. Very interesting. I like it. I like it a lot. I like the style. I oh do too. Gosh, that's, cute. that's really pretty. Taboo. Remember Taboo from Avon? The perfume? Oh, yeah. It didn't smell very good. 
Beth Franklin says it's Ann Margaret. Oh yeah, this cap is this feels like a large cap. Oh, the root. I just love it. Oh my goodness. This is like the first that color pinky. that color's gorgeous on you. Oh my gosh. I have that to have That is like salon this. custom color. I have to have it. That's beautiful. This. You would wear that. I need it. 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 I love where the part is too. It's just barely off center, which is like where my natural part is. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Do I have to take it off? Do I? Yes, you do. We're on schedule. <sighs> okay. This is. We still have an hour and three minutes. So we've only been on here 42 minutes. <laughs> if Kim's dream is true then we have an hour and 45 minutes uh this is arrow and mocha rooted arrow is a lace front mono part oh don't worry kim kim says buy it I, i'm getting it oh my gosh i just love it well since i got the e-clap first you can get that this is a pretty we haven't seen this color <laughs> Maxine says she loves it when Misty gets tinted. That don't take much. <laughs> I like it all. Well, not all. This is mocha rooted. Not crazy about. It's real heavy. That, but I think, I think you could do something about it. I wonder if you could. I wonder if you could steam that back a little bit. Probably. I still haven't got my hands in these wigs to see how they're gonna respond. Yeah. I have the the feel of it. Feels like it's gonna respond really well. Kind of almost like that Aesthetica. Um, they're newer fibers to me. I don't know. The chocolate rooted, the one I was working on for Kim Meyer, the chocolate rooted, the chocolate smoke, it almost felt like a heat defiant. Yeah. And it just re it's responded really well. So this is pretty. It's pretty, but I like the others. I, yeah, I do too, but it's pretty. I love the color. Yeah, this is a little, it's, it's a little warm, but it's not as warm as some of the others. I'm not looking. I'm just looking at my sale. Yeah, that that would need some work. Like that. <laughs> if it were lifted up just a little bit like that. Make all the difference in the world. Okay. Alright, this is Storyville and Hot Storyville. Mocha rooted. Someone talked about Storyville Wasn't earlier. That a show, a TV show. Oh wow! Oh wow! Oh, this is lace front. That's like disco on steroids. That really is Howard Stern. Oh, I can't. Why am I doing that the wrong way? I'm not sure about that one. Maybe. I don't know. I just like the length of the disco. Okay, this is a lot of hair. This is a lot of hair. It's still lightweight, though. And when you feel the hair, it, it feels very fine and nice. I like but I ain't gonna lie. Sorry. Don't like that one. Yeah. This looks like me when I used to go to the beauty shop after a perm. Okay, the color's pretty though. What did we say it was? Hot mocha rooted. Hot mocha rooted. <laughs> Maxine says she wants story view. It's foolish. It's what? You definitely tell a story <laughs> in this one. <laughs> Carol King. Yes, Miss Tony. It oh, is Carol sometimes King. Sometimes when I go home, I just have to put Carol King I on. I love Carol King. So she just makes you. It just makes it me happy. When she sits down at that piano, it's just. Oh. Okay, yeah. This is definitely, this is, I have such curly hair, I can't do a thing with it, so I'm just going to let it go. That's what this is. What says to me? Well, we got more curls. Oh, do we? Oh, oh. Oh. I don't know. I'm not like, 
not liking that one. Okay, this next one is called Jamila Plus in Bernstein Rooted. Oh, Maxine. Maxine says big hair is an in. Oh. Girl, come to Texas. Shoot. Big hair ain't ever gone nowhere. All right. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is a uh, lace front machine made. <laughs> you know, it just kind of hurts my feelings to get laughed at. I was laughing with you. I was laughing yeah, at well, you. I know. I don't oh, understand mercy. the cut, really. Maybe it's a European thing. You know, oh, you know what? This would make a really cute updo. Oh, yeah. With these pieces kind of hanging, kind of, um, what era was that? You could do, yeah, that, and then. Yeah, it would make a cute updo. Hello, Miss Kitty. <laughs> yeah, if you had that hot chili mix, you would be Miss Kitty looking for a mad dilly. Oh, no. Shirley Temple, Harlow Mark, Wolf Cut. <laughs> Yeah, this would be a good updo wig if you wanted some curls. I mean, but you know, curls are a definite hole in the yes, market right and, now because some people have hair that curly. True to that is way cuter what, on you. No, it is not cute. But true to what I'm saying is, I don't have a forehead. But look, I still wouldn't have to do anything to it. It's out of my face. Yeah. I mean, there's. I mean, what do you think, Kim? Look at this shape. <laughs> you know, it's like we always say, we can sit here and say everyone. it's not for us, but there's something for everyone, and somebody that has naturally Still curly look. hair will love that. How cute that would be. Yeah. On the good ship. Okay. Okay. Somebody will love it. This next one is um, a gray wig. It's short. Yeah, Sarah. Sarah says the uh, curls are beautiful. The the curl, the curl pattern. The curl is gorgeous. Is gorgeous the way they've done that. This is called uh, tab and silver mix. So they have a tab and a taboo. This is a, a basic machine made cap with a mono crown. Wasn't the taboo short like that too? Honestly, I don't remember. I think it was. So this one is a little pixie, but it's got just a little bit of curl to it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Really short. Which, I mean, oh, there's a hole I there lost too. My tag. Honestly, because when you get short like that, it either tends to look like too much hair up here, and you start looking like a Q-tip, or it just. But this is this is a good balance. Yeah. <laughs> Rose says, "Okay, I had to shut the TV off and come to my phone so I can say stuff." <laughs> <laughs> oh, taboo was the one I liked. Thank you for keeping up with it, Ken Myers. She said Taboo was the one I liked in Rosewood. Okay. See, I already forgot. Oh, I thought we were on our last one. No, girl. We're getting there. It's only 12.50. We're doing good. Yes, Elizabeth, that's Sandy hair from Greece. Uh, it sure is. It is. I've already got us Halloween costumes. What are we doing now? This is... Beach Mono and Cinnamon Brown mix. Beach Mono. Have you noticed? I don't want to toot my own horn, but this is the first time I hadn't screwed these things up. Oh, yeah. Good job. <laughs> it's really sad when you got to... This is full lace front with a mono part. Ruth, you're right. There's always something um, that looks perfect on the right person. Your daddy said we look like little orphan Annie. Girl. Right. I mean, sir. I'm just happy someone said something about you look little. Oh, I'm I'm gonna the, my takeaway <laughs> from that is you look little. That's <laughs> which, cute. Which my, that's cute. My daddy knows better. His little girl, his little girl ain't little. This is cute. 
This is cute. Love the shorter layers. I'm so glad that layers are coming back mm -hmm. because it just creates a whole nice. Look at that lace. That's yeah. pretty. Because for so long they were doing like the unlayered and so you kind of after a while got this like triangle look going on but that whole layered look just elongates things and it really helps if you have a round face and again the curl so many things are straight and straight's beautiful but i love the fact that she does so much with curl because it gives people options for that want it that cap was comfortable too I just think anything wefted is going to be more comfortable. I, I was kind of a little apprehensive after our last unboxing because not a lot of them I felt like I could wear. But after today, I'm like, oh, wow. Look at, the, I'm like Maxine, look at the options. I got to get off here. I don't have room for any more wigs. <gasps> this is cute. That's real cute. See how I just that layering is just so good. Again, this is a warm color. Yeah, cinnamon brown mix is gonna probably pretty much tell you it's warm. Mm-hmm. But you know it's not too warm. No. It's not too warm. Well, again, when you start getting into the blended, you know, sometimes when they try to do what they'll call cinnamon, you'll end up with like orange tips or an orange chunk that runs through the wig and these are just really natural color. You get a lot of color dimension, but you don't get a bunch of chunks. <laughs> Michael Tannery said, that's a cute for a midlife crisis car. He's teasing me. I, got, I had to get a new car because as y'all know, I had an accident the day before my birthday. Well, the car I got has red leather interior and so he just, he says I'm going through a midlife crisis, and probably I am. Oh, I thought I thought he was talking about he was going through a midlife crisis. Oh well, that's probably true too. Yeah, but he's older than me, so if I if he's going through it, that means I still got some time. Yeah, is sixty mid? Well, if he lives to be one hundred twenty. Yeah. All right. I don't know what what is, is this the last one? I think so. It is. Oh, we got two colors. Which color? Hang on, hang on. We got to see which color. Okay, I'll do the hot chocolate. This one. Y'all, look at this box. <laughs> it's like a yardstick. Okay, I could do a whole show on Misty and her box issues. You will never get this one mixed up with anything else. Look at the whole length of my arm. <laughs> oh. Well, I don't have a convertible. All right, Kathy says she has an appointment in October and want to change color and style. Where do I start? There are too many beautiful choices. You just come on in. We just start trying stuff on. Okay, this... It's in very interesting packaging. The only other thing I've ever seen like this is from Aesthetica. So if you were to order one of these from us, probably I wouldn't suggest we unpack it. Would you? We'll never get that back in there. Well, you can't even take it off. And then you can wear this if you go out at night, if you need a hose. Okay. Just one. You just get one hose. So I've got hot mocha yeah, top on one leg. <laughs> You buy two wigs. <laughs> <laughs> one for each leg. <laughs> oh, that reminds me funny. of a Christmas story. That lamp. Okay. Oh. All right. This is lace front with a mono part. And this is a great sleek. Oh, this is sure pretty. It is. Renee Paris or Noriko, whichever one, tried to do something like this. And it did work out good. But let's see but if, not if like Ellen this. Villa's done it better. She has done it better. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, I was just thinking about hopping on one leg. <laughs> and then, I don't know, trying when I said to see who did it better, I just went back to that picture of you next to <laughs> Steve Perry. <laughs> oh, oh, my gosh. Look, I mean, this, and I mean, I've got a bunch of hair tucked up under here. It is just. Okay, it's not my style because I don't do long and sleek like that, but a lot of people do. And this is this is a huge hole filler. Yeah. <laughs> is there a better way to say that? <laughs> it completes the collection. Yes, and it, look at these PC. Yeah. Oh, love it. Again, look at that lace. That lace looks gorgeous. Oh, my goodness. 
this is going to be huge. It probably already is a huge seller because, I mean, they probably had it for a while. But yeah. this, I'm telling you what, we could sell this all day long. Yeah, we could. What did Beth, Beth said something. Uh, Beth, okay, she, Beth says it seems like the lace front goes to ear to ear. They do so many different cap constructions. Some are temple to temple, some are extended, um, extended, and then some actually go all the way to the ear. So it just we're learning the cap constructions. I love that there's so many different options, and they're very you know they're appropriate for whatever style they've designed. So because you know I'm gonna try to mess it up a little bit because it looks so perfect, which we all know I'm not. Wow, you put a little dry shampoo in that just to get some texture out of it because it feels so soft, which a lot of people would like it soft like that. There is no way anybody know you had a wig on. Uh -uh. No way. And our colors are kind of close. Um, beach and sandy. A lot of times when they, all manufacturers, when they ship the long wigs, they'll do a zigzag part. Otherwise, if they do it straight, it just kind of gets to be too straight and too embedded. And so they'll do it zigzag, and then you kind of have to work the zigzag out. And then it, you have a more natural-looking part. So we, I may not have gotten all of that out, but that's how that works. Oh, my gosh. This is, this is amazing. I'm kind of glad we say this one for last. Yes. Uh, Marita, I thought that was you. I know. I was thinking. I know that name. I just don't know who it is. That's a pretty color. Yes, all of these have highlights. I mean, it's hard to tell on our camera. And that's the liner showing through, so you can see how thin it is up top where it would show your natural. Yeah, you can part. see more highlights in this uh, hot chocolate mix. Cute. All right, should we do a wig of the week? Oh, why not? Several people have said, wow. I don't know if they're saying wow or what's the wig of the week? What's the wow, wow? What's the wow? Chicka bow wow bow how's it go? <laughs> what do you think it should be, Kimberly? I think it should be Jet. I think it should be Jet too. So Jet will be the wig of the week. Which is this by Aesthetica. Um some of the colors are back order, and I ain't gonna lie, but we have quite a few in stock. Um if you get it and it's on back order, you will still get your discount price. Um it's not ready yet. Give me five minutes. Um it's gonna be how much off? 15%, 15% and the coupon code is WOW15, W O W 15. Mm -hmm. So, you have fun. Any of the Ellen Villa wigs that we have tried on, if you're interested, they are not on the website. The amount of detail, um, it, putting them on the website is quite tedious and it takes some time. So, we thought it was more important to show them to you. If you have questions about pricing or you want to order, some, you can call the store or you can email us and we will get the information for you. So Absolutely, just give us a call or send us an email. Um, you can send it to mwigboutique at gmail.com. Make sure you like us on Facebook and follow us. That's two different things. Don't forget about the Wig Chicks group, Mimi's Wig Chicks VIP, and subscribe on YouTube. And you're, it's okay if you share a video. Yes, we'd love to see pictures too. Oh, they want you to stand up so they can um, see the link. So just oh, look at look at this razor cut. Yeah, and it's it's a great razor cut. It doesn't stick. I mean, you get the razor cut look, so you get that nice modern razor cut, but it doesn't just stick out Amazing. like so many of them do. Amazing. All Love right, it. we'll see you next week, same time, same place, and we we've didn't got do an hour and forty five minutes, and we've got more new stuff. Next. Yeah, we got new more stuff. More. We got new more new, stuff. More new stuff. Yes. As soon as we can show that, we are showing. I'm so excited. Well, I'm always excited. Yeah, you are. So. All, right. All right. Have fun shopping, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.